and Gardner will work out of the pistol. The receiver screen to the newly minted number one jersey. Now on the back and the front of Devin Funches. Green and a tailback, and again, they'll set this one up for Norfleet. That receiver screen, good for first down yardage. See Devin Gardner pointing towards the mic. Something new this year with Nussmeyer, and the pass floated to the near side and caught by J.U. Chesson for a first down. It Funches again slotted right. Four-man rush. Gardner looking for Funches, and he has him. Nine-yard strike to Devin Funches. Runs a double move here. The linebacker should stay underneath. He beats him over the top for a touchdown. In the meantime, Taylor has returned at cornerback. Bennett, another receiver screen and nothing doing. Defense by Michigan, we've seen blitzes. Now you see the corner come up, Countess. Come up, make a tackle, make a stick. He's got a new running back out there, Davian Smith, with the tight end Hill in motion. Roll out off the play action, wide open is Funches diving over the DB in a system this year. Much more to come on that, of course, here today. Smith, big hole up the middle across midfield. Get this running game going while it starts up front, and you can see the movement. Look at the blocks, look at the opening for Smith. That's what they needed. To Back to Green in the backfield. They'll use him as the decoy. Gardner stepping up, drops it over the top. Funches at the 10, the 5, fights off a tackle, and Devin scores for the second time with the straight arm. His Gardner, uh, his quarterback is a changed man as well. Yeah, and if you're a Michigan fan, you're extremely excited about this. Look at look at the difference in his mechanics. Roll gets back, he can feel the rush now. Knows where his receivers are going to be. Simply steps up and delivers a ball to Funches, and then it's always nice to have the big fella that can stiff arm someone and get into the end zone. Understand the offense, play action pass, find a soft spot in the zone, stiff arm, get into the end zone. Now Funches already with a couple of scores, slotted left. Gardner puts it in the belly of Green. He gets through a couple of tacklers at the 40 and out across the 45 for the first time. The Hunter of the year in the Big Ten two seasons ago. He was suspended last year, and Bobo Bethard hit as he catches it inside the 10-yard line. Taylor sneaking in, they'll blitz the corner. That's picked up, but then Bryant ran right into the front line with Chris Warmly. Cameron Bryant had time and then ran out of it. Bear hugged by Taco Charlton. We're gonna have to do something to either roll him out, get him outside the pocket, and have time to get rid of it. Cause then he gives up the number 87 number to wear the number one jersey. It was just announced prior to the game today. Gardner looking for Amara Darbo, one of their top young talents, down to the 30-yard line. 14 to nothing. Michigan leading Appalachian State. The give is to Green, and he bumps into the secondary. He's got a blocker downfield. Chesson trying to spring him, and Green caught around the 25. Today, this time, there was no problem getting some movement. Wide open, and here goes Green in the, op in the open field. We talked about he lost the 20 pounds. You can see he looks faster here. Good blocking downfield by Chesson. North Fleet gets a block downfield. Beth, you gotta, you gotta love seeing the receivers get downfield blocks. <laughs> First and goal. Gardner goes under center. Looking for Funches for the third time. The jump ball, and the big guy brings it down in the back of the end zone. Did Funches get a foot down in the back of the end zone? Absolutely, and then, then does he maintain control throughout the catch? And I think that's a definitive yes as well. <laughs> Catches. Damian Smith, the offset back. He'll take it on the delay. Nice cut back to the middle of the field. Across the 50. Smith trying to give it a go. And gets caught 
around the 15-yard line, hauled down at the 12 by Doug Middleton. Another huge run for the Wolverines. And uh, no one to thump, no one to run over. Uh, he, he reels off a big one, but just did not have enough gas to get it to the end zone. Breaks the arm tackle there, and he is off to the races. So already in the first half, with career best 61 yard gallop for number four in the maze and blue, and he bursts into the end zone. Touchdown, Davian Smith. You talked about the maze and blue, but boy, this really looked like the Crimson Tide offense right here. The shotgun handoff to the running back in between the tackle run and just a powerful downhill running game. And I watch Callis get downfield offensive lineman. If you're running back, that's the kind of guy you take to dinner right there. Get that one deflected up at the line of scrimmage. Wolverine's going to try and push it in for six. On the reach for the end zone, touchdown. Had a penalty early in the game on jumping over. This time they just go around the wall, get a piece of the ball. Yeah. And then just nice play here, nice running. Guys blocking downfield. And I'm with you. It looked like the knee was heading down, and somehow he straightened it. Beckard from his own four. And the tackle made, excuse me, that was Isaiah Lewis. Green behind carriage in the eye. They'll try to power it. Green with a nice block from his fullback. And again, the offensive line. Miller pushing all the way downfield. Green inside the 10 and down to the five. His tackles. You know, there, there are some guys that are in position to make this play. That's a tackle that has to be made by Garnett. And this limits this to a five or six yard gain. He misses that tackle and then it's off to the races. How about another receiver? Look at Funches down there getting another block in. The give is to Green to finish it off, and he's in for the touchdown. The keep for Bryant, and he's gobbled up by Clark. He smells this one. He gets outside enough athletic ability to skip the block and get outside to keep Bryant boxed in. <laughs> A terrific day so far for Gardner. He hits Norfleet on the receiver's screen, who's run out of bounds. For Navy, Beth, Joy, back to you guys. Meanwhile, Michigan trying to pad its lead, and they do. Davian Smith scampers in for six. 60 today. Smith slithers through the D and scores played defensively or returning yet in the second half. Bryant will keep and at the 25 yard line. Is Dean Morris on for the first time this year. The last time we saw him was in Michigan's bowl game. And he'll hand it off to Green. Good change of direction to get across midfield. Today I would like to see another receiver get the ball in his hands and have a chance to step up here today with Funches being your main guy. You need that guy opposite of him. Morris, the southpaw, connecting with Keith Heitzman. Morris does a nice job again. The plaction pass is working simply because of the run game that Michigan has shown here today. Morris avoids the rush, steps up, and here's the arm strength coming right here. Falling back, still throws a strike. To my four team playoff, so have to go with him early. Morris with the connection for a first down to Khalid Hill, the tight end. Eight versus the Pac 12 in Oregon. And, and that those games would make statements for the entire conference because those are teams that everyone wonders who's coming out of the big five conferences. Justice Hayes for 18 yards. They were perfect in the red zone this afternoon. They are on the move once again. Drake Johnson inside the 10-yard line. 52 to 14, the final score, Michigan over App State.